It starts with e4, c5, knight f3, knight c6. Now thrust forward with d4, and after black takes, recapture with your knight. When black plays f6 to attack the pawn, defend it with knight to c3. Now d6 and bishop to g5. a6 prevents the two knights and bishop from coming forward, and queen to d2 prepares the castle and supports the bishop. Here, black will play knight to d7 to prevent you from taking the knight and ruining their pawns. Now bishop to e2 to develop your last piece, and after g6, bring the knight to d5. This is where they might make a mistake if they play f6, not even realizing that of course you now have knight to e6 attacking the queen. Queen a5 is the only safe square, but now knight to c7 check. King f7 is basically forced, but now knight to d8 check, king g7, and knight e8 check. And usually they're resigned here, but if they play king to g8, you now have checkmate after 4 moves. Follow me for more checkmate traps.